Jerry and Teresa Smothers say their mule, Peanut, is part of the family. We've had Peanut for 17 years. And they say recently, Peanut added another member to their family. It was really a, you know, a surprise, a shock, and something that wasn't supposed to happen. Peanut had a baby, which left the Smothers family a bit confused because mules are supposed to be sterile since they have an odd number of chromosomes. It was a million to one shot. Peanut has roamed fields with their neighbor Sam Beck's donkeys and horses for more than a decade. When Beck found the baby, he was shocked as well. I called Jerry and told him we was going to have a custody battle over to see who it was. And I said, no, Sam, you're confused. I said, uh, mules don't have babies. And he said, well, you should have told her that before she got pregnant. She's not even a month old, but the tiny girl hasn't had an easy start. And I called Jerry. I said, Jerry, I don't think it's going to make it. At first, Peanut wasn't producing milk, and the baby's liver and kidneys weren't doing well. If we wanted to save her, she needed to go to Park Equine. Jerry and Teresa credit Beck and the veterinarians at Park Equine Hospital with saving the baby's life. Since then, she's been a hit around town and on social media. Yes, she's becoming popular. Now that she's home and doing better every day, all they had to do was give her a name, and they went with Miracle. And it just goes to show you that, you know, nothing's impossible. Covering the news in Boyle County, Tiffany Jackson, LEX 18 News.